Everybody, Scott Kelby here, and this is your Lightroom Tip Tuesday. We're talking about today how to add text to your prints. So we're in Lightroom Classic, of course. We're in the Print module. And if you take a look over here, if you want to add your nameplate or something down here to a finer name, this is a friend of my, my his, his, he's got a very cool car, and he let me photograph it. So let's add some text. So I'm going to go over here, and where you go is to the Page panel. You're going to turn on Identity Plate, and it's going to put whatever name you have your software registered as in. And I'm just going to pull it down here till we can see it. And there you go. Now, that text is edited by going over here to the same panel. And if you zoom in here at the bottom right corner, there's a little... Well, that got out of control. There's a little... <laughs> pop down menu right here you click on it and you're going to choose edit because what it gives you is the main identity plate whatever you had there before but you can customize it so if you click on this edit button right i'll show you what it does it brings up a little identity plate editor window and you can type in whatever you want you can highlight it yes you have to highlight it to choose the font and choose the uh weight of the font that's the word i'm looking for and you can choose your scale here but you can also just resize it using the handle so i don't worry too much about that you can also choose the color over here in this little swatch now you see the spacing between the letters here this is terrible this is what you have to do <laughs> you tap and hit the space bar tap and hit the space bar you have to do it manually yes i know what you're thinking isn't adobe kind of the company that created <laughs> typography on a computer aren't they the ones that did postscript and isn't that yes which is stunningly surprising that you're having to do it this way but you can't expect them to get this right it's only been around for like 14 years so you got to give them a break anyway click ok and that's how you do that and again you can change the scale here and you can reposition it and such now there's another text field you can use if you go over here uh, down to the um, this little section page options there's a thing called a uh, page info and right below that is photo info that's the one you want turn it on and it puts a little caption under your photo well by default what it does is it it puts the file name but you can put any custom text you want in there so you can go to custom text and it puts a little field there and you can type in whatever you want so that's a what is it tesla tesla i'm trying to spell it here tesla model x right and then you can choose the size you want and stuff like that and there you so it's kind of look at it as a caption if you wanted a caption of course and you have one embedded into the file you could just choose caption but there you go there's a couple of different ways to add some text to your prints in lightroom classic and that my friends is your lightroom tip tuesday